to another video. So in today's video, I'm going to be serving you guys some Kim K inspired recent press looks that I feel like she freaking killed it. So I went ahead and threw a poll up on my Instagram and asked you guys what outfits you guys wanted to see me recreate for less. So these are the ones that you guys chose. I'm going to do things a little bit different here. I'm not going to show you guys each piece. I'm going to go ahead and jump on into the looks and give you guys a more in-depth as I'm try them on, show you guys the outfit side by side, and you guys let me know what it is that you think. Do you feel like I nailed it? I actually really had a lot of fun filming this video. So if you want me to do another celebrity look for less, let me know in the comments down below, and let's jump right into this video. Okay, so here's the first look, you guys. I'm so freaking obsessed. Kim Kardashian's outfits obviously are going to be more tailored to her body. These I just pulled out of the Pretty Little Thing packaging, so they're a little bit wrinkled, and they could be a little bit tailored better, especially these pants, but we're going to work with what we got. And in my opinion, I am so freaking obsessed with this outfit. This shirt is so much more expensive looking, and the quality just feels more luxurious than what I paid for it. This top was under $30 you guys I am freaking obsessed I definitely know I need it in a good black color maybe even white I love it I probably could have gone with an extra small this is a size small and it, it does look like it runs a little bit oversized but I don't mind it pair it with a good light wash pair of denim obsessed. I feel like this is the perfect transitional piece into the fall time. The pants that Kim Kardashian wore were the exact freaking color of her top and I'm usually a freaking stickler about that. They're the only satin champagne pants I could freaking find on the internet and they still even have somewhat of a pattern in them. Hers didn't but I actually don't mind it because I feel like in between the pattern it's kind of light so it ties in this top perfectly. She has every look that I'm about to show Show you guys paired with either a nude or a black in between the toe Yeezy. I'm not really a fan of that shoe so I wasn't trying to find a dupe. So I just went ahead and paired it with a clear pair of heels. I feel like everybody needs a clear pair of heels because they go with freaking every look. So this is going to be the shoe that I'm wearing with every look but that's okay. What do you guys think? I love this look. You will definitely be catching me wear this outfit super soon. And I think these pants were like under $10, you guys. Right now, Pretty Little Thing is also running a really good deal. So if you don't want to recreate any of these looks, you can definitely go in and add a few pieces into your fall wardrobe for a really good price. I'm dying, I'm so freaking hot. <laughs> okay, here's outfit number two. I am absolutely obsessed with this top, but beware, it is kind of itchy because it is like a sequindy type of material. Wait until I show you guys the back. It is so good. But you're gonna have to wait just a second. These pants are not my most favorite and her pants that she wore were a little bit more boxier but since you know your girls got hella curves these pants came in just a little bit tighter than I expected and they didn't have I didn't realize that they had pockets I guess I really wasn't paying attention and they actually aren't my most favorite if I was paying attention I probably would have picked a different pant but nonetheless I don't mind it she also did wear a clear black heel, but I'm just pairing it with a black pump. And I really like this look. What do you guys think? Let me show you guys the back. Here is the back of the top. I still have the tag on because if I take the tags off, I will not know the names of these pieces, throw it away, and literally be screwed. So don't mind the tag, but I love the freaking back. So since you can't really wear a bra with it. I feel like if you have like smaller-ish boobs and you don't need that much support, you're gonna be totally okay because you can tie the back really tight and you don't really get a lot of side boob and the little scoop in the front does really keep everything covered up so you don't have to worry about not wearing a bra. I don't have a bra on right now. This is the last look and this was actually the look that I was the most excited to recreate because this was the look that I felt the most like excited about when I saw her wear it. I was like yes 
You freaking came to slay. You killed it. She actually had a black sweater on with a collar. I could not find a black sweater with a collar anywhere. So I went ahead and just did an oversized like linen-y button-down top. And I actually really like the way that it came out. I probably would tuck it in just a little bit more, but it's a little bit more slouchy than I probably would wear it. But it still doesn't look bad. She had more of a rhinestone skirt on. And I know exactly like what kind of material it was because I actually had have a dress made out of the same material her skirt was and I wore that dress for my bridesmaids party and that dress was really for my bridesmaids party and I wore that dress for my bachelorette party but that dress was really freaking expensive because it had real like Swarovski rhinestones on it and I did go ahead and get crafty and put the lace on myself it actually isn't like the exact lace that I would have chose but I was crunched on time and I actually forgot to buy the glue that I was going to use to put it on so I had to pin it so we're not going to get that close but I love the skirt and I love the top together what do you guys think I feel like overall I nailed this celebrity look for less so that's going to be it guys I'm going to go ahead and end this video here I'm literally dying of a heat stroke like I'm about to fall over no joke I hope you guys enjoyed this video if you want me to do any other celebrity looks for less that was literally a tongue twister if you want me to do any other celebrity looks looks for less. Let me know in the comments down below. Go ahead and give this video a thumbs up if you want me to start this as a series. And until my next video, I will catch you guys later. Bye!